This is the Unitarian Church of Lincoln's daily video update for Tuesday, August 11th, 2020. I'm the Reverend Oscar Sinclair, and in this series, we are exploring our tradition's seven principles. Our sixth principle is a reflection of the second. While the second principle speaks of justice, equity, and compassion in human relationship, the sixth is framed this way the goal of world community with peace, liberty, and justice for all. Peace, liberty, and justice are, are not simply things that we work for on an individual level, but as a society. And here's why that's important. There's a debate right now. Where does the concept of racism exist, right? Lots of folks will say something like, I've done the work, but there isn't a racist bone in my body. They see racism as primarily a problem of human relationship through individual sin and reconciliation, through a frame not unlike the second principle, which puts the I-thou relationship at the center. What that view misses, though, and what the sixth principle points to, is the scale of justice that is needed. Because we know racism doesn't just exist in individuals, it exists in systems. You can have a system of well-meaning people, and the system can still create inequitable outcomes. We know this because we've seen it. And so it's not just enough to work for justice and equity in our relationships. We need to think big. Sometimes that's pretty literal. There's a Unitarian Universalist office at the United Nations in New York, or in an emphasis on systemic change for justice. More on that in a few days when we talk about a proposed eighth principle. <laughs>